Chapter 28 The Lord said to Moses, Give these instructions to the people of Israel. The offerings you present to me by fire on the altar are my food, and they are very pleasing to me. See to it that they are brought at the appointed times and offered according to my instructions. Say to them, When you present your daily whole burnt offerings to the Lord, you must offer two one-year-old male lambs with no physical defects. One lamb will be sacrificed in the morning and the other in the evening. With each lamb you must offer a grain offering of two quarts of choice flour mixed with one quart of olive oil. This is the regular burnt offering ordained at Mount Sinai, an offering made by fire very pleasing to the Lord. Along with it you must present the proper drink offering, consisting of one quart of fermented drink with each lamb, poured out in the holy place as an offering to the Lord. Offer the second lamb in the evening with the same grain offering and drink offering. It too is an offering made by fire, very pleasing to the Lord. On the Sabbath day, sacrifice two one-year-old male lambs with no physical defects. They must be accompanied by a grain offering of three quarts of choice flour mixed with olive oil and a drink offering. This is the whole burnt offering to be presented each Sabbath day in addition to the regular daily burnt offering and its accompanying drink offering. On the first day of each month, present an extra burnt offering to the Lord of two young bulls, one ram, and seven one-year-old male lambs, all with no physical defects. These will be accompanied by grain offerings of choice flour mixed with olive oil, five quarts with each bull, three quarts with the ram, and two quarts with each lamb. This burnt offering must be presented by fire, and it will be very pleasing to the Lord. You must also give a drink offering with each sacrifice, two quarts of wine with each bull, two and a half pints for the ram, and one quart for each lamb. Present this monthly burnt offering on the first day of each month throughout the year. Also on the first day of each month you must offer one male goat for a sin offering to the Lord. This is in addition to the regular daily burnt offering and its accompanying drink offering. On the appointed day in early spring you must celebrate the Lord's Passover. On the following day, a joyous seven-day festival will begin, but no bread made with yeast may be eaten. On the first day of the festival, you must call a sacred assembly of the people. None of your regular work may be done on that day. You must present as a burnt offering to the Lord two young bulls, one ram, and seven one-year-old male lambs, all with no physical defects. These will be accompanied by grain offerings of choice flour mixed with olive oil, five quarts with each bull, three quarts with the ram, then two quarts with each of the seven lambs. You must also offer a male goat as a sin offering to make atonement for yourselves. You will present these offerings in addition to your regular morning sacrifices on each day of the seven days of the festival. This is how you will prepare the food offerings to be presented by fire, very pleasing to the Lord. These will be offered in addition to the regular whole burnt offerings and drink offerings. On the seventh day of the festival, you must call another holy assembly of the people. None of your regular work may be done on that day. On the first day of the festival of harvest, when you present the first of your new grain to the Lord, you must call a holy assembly of the people. None of your regular work may be done on that day. A special whole burnt offering will be offered that day, very pleasing to the Lord. It will consist of two young bulls, one ram, and seven one-year-old male lambs. These will be accompanied by grain offerings of choice flour mixed with olive oil, five quarts with each bull, three quarts with the ram, and two quarts with each of the seven lambs. Also, offer one male goat to make atonement for yourselves. These special burnt offerings, along with their drink offerings, are in addition to the regular daily burnt offering and its accompanying grain offering. Be sure that all the animals you sacrifice have no physical defects.